Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. All right, here we go. <laughs> Welcome to Game Grumps. Hello. We're 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 back. We're I I I feel like we're starting to circle the uh the drain here on this uh on this case. What are you, Katy Perry? What what did she say that? There's a song it's called "Circle the Drain." I mean, it's a it's a saying that millions of people have said. I know, but this has invoked an image but in my head. Of Katy Perry, though, <laughs> she's cute. Yeah, you're gonna hear her roar. She did that song with Zed three six five. It's pronounced Z. We're not Canadians. <laughs> no, the the EDM artist who tweeted about sequelitis once. It's pronounced Adam. December 27th. 10 a.m. Just after Christmas. <laughs> Court is now in session for the trial of Mr. Miles Edgeworth. I'm glad we're all working right now, even though I should be with my, pe my family celebrating the days after Christmas. <laughs> the defense is ready, Your Honor. <laughs> Very well, apparently the prosecution is also ready. Who is the judge here anyway? Mr. Von Karma, your opening statement. I hate you. <laughs> uh, very well, no opening statement, so... <laughs> Not so fast, judge. I was taking a meaningful pause before speaking. Oh. <laughs> right, of course. Not so meaningful. You're... an asshole. <laughs> a prediction. Snap. Today's trial will end three minutes from now. Oh, cool. Wow, how cool of you to say. What a douche. Order, order. Mr. Von Karma, what is the meaning of your statement just now? Just thought I would make the game portion of this more interesting. Bruh. Must you question everything? It will be over in three minutes. We have no time to waste. I'll call my witness now. Uh, right! I- I'm a beta male cuck. <laughs> I call my witness, my, my decisive witness to the stand. I don't want to watch no betas. It's that mysterious boat shop owner. I, I don't, I mean, I don't know that. I, I would never know that. Witness, state your profession. I am the proprietor of the restaurant The Wet Noodle at Gord Lake. Snap. And I, uh, also rent boats. The night of the incident, you were in the boat rental shop, correct? Uh, uh yep, yep I was. Please testify. Wait a second. Take me to church. We still haven't heard who this <laughs> old guy is, and I'm working like a dog. <laughs> the shrine of your light. What do you want uh, to do? Oh, um... We should probably raise an objection. Yeah, I, th I mean, yeah. Yeah, we gotta know who he is. Who the heck is this guy? Wait a minute! The witness hasn't stated his name yet, you freaking freak. Because I did not ask him, Mr. Wright. Blah! Well, then you're I the have, one who's in fault. I have predicted this trial will end in three minutes. <laughs> now it's 3.05. Stop asking trivial questions and cooperate. Yeah, right. The witness will state his name. <laughs> well, uh, I'm not really sure, hey, yep. What do you mean? Mayor, memory. Your Honor, the witness does not remember anything beyond the last several years. Ergo, he cannot recall his own name. <laughs> Therefore, we should put this man's life in the hands of someone who truly has no idea what's going on. Hmm, he can't recall, you say? Yes, but the incident in question took place three days ago. He can testify. Very well. Let's hear his testimony then, shall we? Witness? Okay. All right. It was the night of the 24th, just after midnight, eh, yep. I was in the restaurant where I uh, rent boats, as usual. Then I heard a bang! Hey, eh, yep. When I looked out the window, I saw a boat just uh, floating on the lake. When I heard another bang! <laughs> Just about then, the boat comes back to shore and a man walks by my window. And he's all like, I love Katy Perry. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> very well. I do too. I'd like to begin the cross-examination. <laughs> There's nothing to question in my witness's testimony. This guy is such a fucking tool. 
Nothing. Ergo, no need for cross-examination. Also, did you like Katy Perry's album Witness? What do you think of my ascot? Besides, there are only ten seconds left before our three minutes are up. Judge, your verdict, now. Uh, yes, Mr. Wright? Of course I'm going to- Oh, are you kidding me? Mean. You so Suck my balls, dude! <laughs> I'm cross-examining this guy. Yeah, what are you saying? Of course I'll cross-examine the witness. Hmm, very well. You may begin. You have eight seconds. What the- <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Von Karma. Three minutes just passed. I see. Well, then, let's just take our time. <laughs> you may cross-examine the witness. Okay. The night of the murder. <laughs> the murder! <laughs> Making murders! And the night of the 24th, in the restaurant where I rent boats, and I heard a bang. When I looked out the window, I saw a boat just a floating on the lake. And I heard another bang. Just about then, the boat comes back to shore, and a man walks by my window. Okay, that seems significant. Yeah. Uh, by your window? Hey, yeah, by my window. Right outside the window of my little shack. Hey, window. And could you see the man's face? Well, the fog was pretty darn thick, but he was right there in front of me. I saw him. I saw him, I did. This is a rather important detail. Please add it to your testimony. Yeah, you best. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay. That man was the defendant. He was saying, I can't believe he's dead. Uh, you said you didn't remember. Uh, are you sure? Uh oh. D Dad? <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Dead certain, Keith! He said, I can't believe he's dead as he was walking by, too. Witness, are you sure that the person who saw was Miles Edgeworth? It was him! That Edgeworth boy! Me! <laughs> My spinal column. Shake it off. <laughs> um, He's dead. This sounds like decisive evidence indeed. I see no room for doubt. Von Karma. He lured me into cross-examining so they could set me up for a fall. Nick, I don't like the way things are going here. Yeah. You're blowing me it! Me neither. <laughs> Everyone in the courtroom is glaring at us. Better act quick, or this trial is going to be over. Raise an objection! Okay. I, I don't know what I'm doing! <laughs> Your Honor, I made way over my head! <laughs> we proved in yesterday's trial that it could not have been Edgeworth who fired that gun. Mr. Wright, are you referring to the fingerprints from Edgeworth's right hand found on the gun, and the photograph showing a man firing with his left hand? It was photographed through a mirror, of course! Yes. Exactly! You stupid bastard. That is easily explainable. He could have wiped his prints after he fired. And then put more prints on, incredibly carelessly. <laughs> you are ignoring the truth of the matter here. Everything in this witness's testimony is true. Uh, I don't know about hmm. that. The judge has lost the thought. What should I do? Uh, raise an objection. Hmm, okay. Uh, Your Honor! Again, I'm- I'm really lost here. <laughs> This witness claims that Edgeworth said, I can't believe he's dead, but his word is all we have. If he were telling a lie... Mr. Wright, in a court of law, the evidence tells all. Apparently, you have yet to realize even this basic fact. <laughs> if you say his testimony is a lie, show us proof. Um... Nick, do we have evidence? It's no good. There's nothing I can do. Uh, are you sure? Uh, to be honest, I don't know what to do anymore. Please! Please! <laughs> Can you hear me, sis? Please! Please! We need your help! Nick needs you! Three minutes was perhaps too high an expectation. However, fifteen minutes isn't bad. This must be a new record. And I believe we're talking quite slowly. <laughs> if that was fifteen minutes. Enough! The witness may leave the stand. <laughs> oh boy. Well, that was stupid. This court sees no reason to further prolong the trial. Nor is there any need for more time to decide the case against the defendant. What do you mean? The case is extremely clear. I see no room for misinterpretation of the facts. What? No. Hmm. 
The court finds the defendant, Mr. Miles Edgeworth, dot dot guilty. Oh, dip. Did you blow it? Um. The accused will surrender to the court immediately to be held pending trial at a higher court within a month from today's date. That is all. This court is adjourned. Damn. Wow. What? Wait! What? Who, who was that just now? Me. Huh? What? Wah! L Larry! It's Larry Potts! Yeah! What are you doing here? Listen, you gotta listen to me. I, I was... First of all, I have a girlfriend named Keyonce. She's great and real. Boy, I love hanging out with her on real dates all the time. <laughs> I was there in the park the night of the murder. I, I wasn't sure about it until just yesterday. But, but today I remembered it. Remembered what? The gunshot. I heard it too. Okay. Order. This is a fucking circus. Yeah. The verdict has been decided. I call for adjournment. <laughs> One moment, Mr. Von Karma. This is a fucking kangaroo court, and I will allow it. <laughs> so you say you heard a gunshot? Yeah, I did. A gunshot. That night. And I'm totally telling the truth. A super for realsies. I was sitting here in the audience, listening to the testimony. Then I realized something he said was different from what I remember. Yeah? Anyhow, I can't just sit here and let you call Edgy a murderer. That's right, son. It's- it's just not right. I'll testify. Let me testify. Let me take you to church. Order, order. Order, order. Well, this is the first time something has happened like this in my court. Not yeah, sure. really. Yeah, and I'm not quite sure how to proceed. Judge, you've already given your decision. Snap. The trial is over. Nick! This is it! Larry's given us one final chance at this! She's right. If only it wasn't Larry. He could make things even worse. He I mean, smells like butt. <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth was just declared guilty, Nick. It doesn't get any worse. You're right. Okay. Wait, didn't he think that? Ah, eh, well, whatever. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> he just like turns to her. Whoa, hold. What? Y Your Honor! I can see you checking off. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you jacking off in your head right now. Why are you jacking off in your head? All right. We're in a courtroom. There's another witness. If there is another witness, it is our duty to hear him speak. Right here, right now. I love Frat Boy Slim. <laughs> a waste of time. The verdict cannot be overturned. Hmm. Slap. Allow me to speak my opinion. I am in, the judge after all. In all court proceedings, it is our duty per to prevent an inaccurate verdict. In order to make sure no mistake has been made, every witness should be heard. B what is this? I withdraw my previous verdi verdict of guilty. Hell In yeah. order to do that, I must speak guilty backwards. Elog. <laughs> Did that work? <laughs> 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 Mr. Von Karma! I, I already call this new witness to testify. Now. What? The court will adjourn for a five minute recess. Oh, Laszlo is playing Splatoon. <laughs> After that, we will hear this new witness. Court is adjourned. Everybody get a sandwich or something. Yeah. You've earned it. Calm your tits. <laughs> it's 28 minutes later. We're in defendant lobby number two. Woo! That was too close. And next time on Game Grumps, we're gonna talk to Edgeworth about how it went. I cannot wait! I can't either! Yeah.